It was Nigeria's finest hour at the United Nations Security Council debate on Ebola as Nigeria received overwhelming commendations for her leadership role and the swift reaction to the outbreak of the epidemic. Member states put it more succinctly in their contributions to the debate. The concept note prepared by Nigeria, thank you for that, to guide this session documents the importance of regional arrangements. Obviously we share that optimism and it is the result of a series of correct decisions over the past few months and over the past year. One of those, Madam President, is clearly the example uh, offered by Nigeria in the way that it quickly and transparently reacted to the threat of Ebola uh, when it uh, crossed its borders. And this was a model of uh, uh, good practices and all uh, of us need to draw the right lessons from that, that kind of example. I also want to commend Nigeria's swift and methodical response to two outbreaks within its own borders during the epidemic, including one in Lagos, a city of more than 21 million people, which show how we can effectively contain Ebola with the right response. From the nurturing of stable and decisive leadership and community ownership to synergy of long-term solidarity, Apex United Nations health officials and member states celebrated what they called Nigeria's unwavering leadership. Ebola, a global crisis of unprecedented proportions, described by the council president, Nigeria's Professor Joy Ogu, as a health threat with an alarming ability to ignore national borders, requires concerted efforts to hit the zero tolerance target. Having encountered and vigorously overcome the Ebola virus disease, Nigeria, I believe, can share lessons from its experiences in the fight, which included high levels of vigilance and contact tracing, rapid introduction of requisite control measures, strong government and community commitment, prompt WHO intervention in collaboration with the government, and unalloyed commitment of dedicated health workers. We also embarked on a robust campaign to create public awareness about the disease and successfully avoided dissemination of false information, rumors, and undue panic among the, the citizenry. In fact, at a point, it was taboo to have a handshake. Adoption of Security Council Landmark Resolution 2177 also strengthened the international community to eradicate the epidemic. However, member states underscored the need for strong sustainable regional and international partnerships, as shown by the African Union. In an interview with journalists after the debate, Professor Joy Ogu expressed satisfaction with the Security Council's narrative about Nigeria. We've heard so much about Boko Haram in this community. And people have forgotten that at the regional level, at the national level, so much was done by African countries to mobilize in the effort to fight back Ebola. So this is the day for recognizing, and our concept note was very clear. From the United Nations headquarters in New York, Joy Usiago, NTA News.